Let us go through the main concepts in the chapter permutations and combinations. Factorial. If n is a positive integer, n factorial is the product of n, n minus 1, n minus 2 and so on till 1. 0 factorial is 1, 1 factorial is 1, 2 factorial is 2, 3 factorial is 3 into 2 into 1, 6 and it goes on. Permutations. The different ways in which a set of things can be ordered or arranged by taking some or all at a time. For example, consider there are 5 persons and the number of ways of arranging 3 persons in a row out of these 5 persons will be 5p3. Out of 5, we arrange 3 persons. Here, the order matters. Out of C A B C is different from C B A. So N P R is equal to N factorial by N minus R factorial. So 5 P3 will be 5 factorial by 2 factorial that is 60. N P1 is N and N P N is N factorial. Coming to combinations. What are combinations? The different ways of selecting several objects out of a larger group. The, unlike permutations, the order does not matter here. Here we select. For example, consider a group of 5 persons and you have to select 3 persons. This can be done in 5C3 ways. Here, the order doesn't matter. Selecting A, B, C is the same as selecting C, B, A. Selection and permutations is arrangement. 5C3 will be NCR is N factorial by R factorial into N minus R factorial. So 5C3 is 10. NC1 is N and NCN is also 1. So NCR will be NC N minus R. And another formula NCR is equal to NPR by R factorial.